To create a chain with physics, I'll start by adding a torus. Then I'll switch to edit mode, enable edge select, and turn on x-ray. I'll select half of the torus and move it along the x-axis. Next, I'll set the origin to the center of mass and position the torus in the center of the workspace. Now, using Shift plus D, I'll duplicate it, move it along the x-axis, and rotate it 90 degrees. With both selected, I'll duplicate them again using Shift plus D and move them on the x-axis. Then I'll repeat this step using Shift plus R until we get the chain to the length we want. Now, with the first link selected, I'll enable Rigid Body, set the shape to Mesh, and the type to Passive. I'll do the same for the last link, but set it as Active instead. Then I'll select all the remaining links, making sure the last one selected is the active link. Go to Object, then Rigid Body, then Copy from Active to apply the same physics settings. When I press Play, the physics will kick in, and the chain will move naturally. That's how to make a dynamic, physics-based chain in Blender. Thanks for watching. See you next time.